Fibonacci number. Consider the Fibonacci sequence. To calculate the nth number in the Fibonacci sequence, it equals the sum of the previous two numbers in the sequence. For example, to calculate the second number in the sequence, it equals the sum of the zeroth number plus the first number in the sequence. And so ultimately, the second number in the sequence equals 1. Given an integer n, return the nth Fibonacci number. We will solve this in O of n time. The idea is to always keep track of the previous two numbers in the sequence in order to calculate the current number. We then iterate from 2 through n, and we calculate the current Fibonacci number in the sequence. It equals the sum of the previous two numbers in the sequence, a and b, and so we want to move these pointers forward by advancing a and setting it equal to b, and we want to advance b to the current number in the sequence. And we continue to the next number in the sequence. It equals the sum of the previous two numbers in the sequence. And so we want to advance these pointers forward by setting a equaling the value at b and advancing b to the current number in the sequence. And we continue and calculate the next number in the sequence. It equals the sum of the previous two numbers. And so we want to advance a by setting it equal to b and we want to advance b by setting it equal to the current number in the sequence. At the very end, b will contain the nth number in the Fibonacci sequence. And here's the code to do so. Please like and follow for more.